And as you guys can see, I'm gonna go ahead and pull up my phone right now and go over to my maid's bank just so I can show you how much money I've actually made from this money glitch. As you guys can see in my bank right now, I literally have over $40 million just from doing this money glitch, man. So it's absolutely insane. And you definitely need to try this out so you can get rich in GTA 5 online right now. Yo, what's good everybody on YouTube? It's your boy Shader Rich coming back to you guys live with a brand GTA 5 online video. And in today's video, of course, I got a really easy GTA 5 solo money glitch for you guys. It's gonna help you make a ton of money in GTA 5 online. But of course, guys, you already know the deal. Before we get right into today's video, you already know about the trillion dollar modded account giveaway. If you don't, well, listen up. I'm giving away this modded account to a lucky subscriber. So if you guys wanna enter, make sure you drop a like on the video. Also, make sure you subscribe to the YouTube channel with all notifications turned on. And the final step for you guys to do is go ahead and comment what day you guys subscribed if you subscribe today let me know in the comment section right now you subscribe today and let's get right into today's video yo so to start off this easy money glitch you guys don't need anything in gta online okay there are a few recommendations that'll help you do this money glitch a lot faster and easier you guys can get a ton of tear gas you guys can also get just like a weapon that has like a hundred rounds in it or an alien weapon all right it's not required but it is recommended to help you guys do this efficiently you guys may remember my modded capture job or my modded survival job well this is my actual survival job and essentially how I set this up is I put a bunch of fences on Vespucci Beach on the basketball court and I set up some modded spawn locations so NPCs can just come spawn in extremely quickly and they're all gonna pile up in one spot okay now from this job you're going to be able to make a ton of money and you're gonna be able to do it in a limited amount of times now I want to let you guys know that when you guys are doing this if you get wasted one time that's it you lose so make sure you guys stay outside of the fence okay you do not want to be inside the fence if you are inside the fence the npc players do have knives i couldn't set it to where they didn't have any weapons so they have to carry knives so if you are in there if they hit you twice that's it like the game is over so make sure you guys just stay outside of the fence and be very aware of what happens on the outside of the fence because sometimes the npcs do slip through if you use an explosive or you set them on fire what's gonna happen is they're gonna start to slip through the fence and like i said it just takes two hits with that knife and you're literally wasted so please make sure you guys be very careful when you're doing this now like i said there's a few weapons that i recommend you have to do this just so it's easier as you guys can see i'm using the widow maker and i believe this is like one of the best weapons you could use any alien weapon is good also you guys can use a proximity mine so that way when they walk up on a proximity mine they literally just set it off and then they explode and then it gets through the rounds pretty fast like I said this is time consuming so the fastest way to get through the rounds is to use the weapons that I'm telling you to so that way you don't have to deal with like using weapons that's gonna take you forever like if you use the AK you're literally gonna be standing there wasting all of your ammo which costs you money and you're literally gonna be doing this for way longer than you need to. So like I said, guys, make sure you use an alien weapon like the Widowmaker, or you guys can use like the proximity mines, but those are also very expensive. I found the uh, tear gas to be the most efficient though, and I'm gonna show you guys, I'm actually gonna slow down the gameplay. So what I do before each round is I throw five into that corner, and then I just go run over into the corner from the outside, but I stand far enough away to where the tear gas doesn't do anything to me. Now you guys can see as soon as they walk into the pile of the five tear gas, they just literally get wasted immediately. You start getting RP, and you are getting through this wave a lot faster than you normally would but like I said man as you guys can see look how fast they're just literally passing out like flies man literally passing out like flies as they walk but remember when I told you guys be very careful because sometimes they do slip through I don't know how I think the spawn glitches out and it just kind of lets them get out and then from there they come and attack you so yeah just be careful with that but here's where I actually fell because like I said I did the number one rule I broke the number one rule not going inside the fence and I was trying to test out other things and I was trying to do the tear gas but I took a little too long so of course they ran up on me and I failed but as far as how much you can make from this if you complete the whole thing I believe you make 75k to 100k so if you have nothing in GTA online you should definitely try this out go ahead and click the link in the description below to bookmark this job so you can play it on your console and yeah man if you guys want to see more videos just like this make sure you subscribe and notifications turn on and if you want to see another money glitch right now click the video on the screen